barged my door down. We rushed downstairs to see what was going on. Rex was in the other room, not barking at them, but they still felt the need to use that wire collar around his neck. When they took him, they kept him in a cage away from me for three months. When I saw him, I was shocked. It was no blanket, he was so skinny. The cage, I was, it was blood and feces all over the floor. I can't stop thinking about the stress they put him through and it wasn't even necessary. Rex never harmed anyone. He didn't do anything to deserve this treatment. This was bullying based on a false stereotype that we've created. The council prohibits the residents to occupy the premises with exempt dogs. <laughs> For what reason? Even the court has deemed him not a danger, so why can't I live here with an exempt dog? I'm sorry. I'm afraid you will have to either find yourself another accommodation with next two months or euthanize the dog. Why so drastic? I'll just keep him at my mum's. I'm afraid you can't do that either. The hardest ultimatum you could be delivered. Lose your best friend or be forced out of your home. I know what you're thinking, just move house. If I had that option, then my Rex would still be here. Shakira and I have been campaigning for animal rights for years. I had no idea about the BSL law. Shakira had seen some similar cases and been through the same thing. She'd recently moved to my area and transferred to my vets. I went down there the next day and asked to see her. We campaigned, we wrote to MPs, we picketed outside the DSO offices, we wrote to police, we did everything we could, but two months isn't a long enough time to fight for your freedom. It breaks my heart, but if we don't do this, they will throw you on the streets. I've seen it happen before, and then you lose him and your home. I've managed to swap it with Jill, so rest assured that Rex will be happy. I can uh, book him in for tomorrow morning, if you like. I'm sorry. I'm grateful I was able to spend one last night with Rex. It could have been the best night of his life. Even if it was the worst night of mine. I'm happy to be here, fighting for a good, strong cause. BSL, it's a law brought in to lower dog bites in this country. Since the laws come in, dog bites have actually risen. <laughs>